Good morning guys and welcome to another vlog. I'm sitting if you're new here and happy Monday. Uh, this is going to be, also look how tan I am because I got a spray tan last night. This is going to be a prep with me for another trip and this is going to be a super little trip. It's from Tuesday to Thursday and like two of those are practically travel days for half of the day so we're not going to be there for long but we're going to california for an amazon trip which i'm really really excited about and it's actually like an amazon event so there's going to be people speaking at it it's not like a retreat type getaway it's more so like i think just for influencers that do a lot with amazon are going to be there i actually don't really know what to expect but i saw a lot of the people that are speaking it's going to be a cool little event and also i've only been California once so I was like I am going to take advantage of the opportunities that I do get even though I just got back from travel and I was like excited to get back into my routine you know the routine will be there and also we're going to do the best we can to stay on track while traveling since this is more of like a work trip and I just had a travel that I just had a trip to Puerto Rico where I kind of like let loose, let myself get off my routine and normal like eating habits and everything. And this time, like since I do have a lot of travel coming up, we're gonna be, this is gonna show you a little bit more about like staying on track while traveling. So if you travel while you are working or if you just travel super often and like you don't wanna get in and out of your routine, that's what this is gonna be all about. But today is going to be a day of prep for the most part. So I'm gonna start off going to uh, get a workout in. So I have that at, I think I'm gonna probably go in like about an hour to that. And I've been up doing some computer work. So that's what we've been up to this morning. It's eight o'clock right now. And it's gonna be a good little day. But I figured I would probably do like today and tomorrow since tomorrow is just gonna be like traveling, settling into the hotel and everything. And yeah, it's gonna be a fun couple days of vlogs. And I'm excited to take you guys along. We've been on a, a vlog and grind lately. So I've pretty much shown you guys every day, which I love doing. I think Vlogmas, kicked me into this gear of like, I just will bring my camera with me everywhere. <laughs> but good morning, guys. Okay, here's my gym fit for today. I'm thinking that when we're in California, I'll probably just do group fitness classes rather than getting like a week gym membership because we're only there for a couple days. I might try like berries and then also I know that camp, which I do camp here in Tampa, I know that they have a location in LA as well. So maybe I'll try that and Here's a little fit, a little aloe set. Aloe, I think these might be four inch biker shorts and then this V-neck sports bra and aloe sweatshirt and my hokas. Workout complete. We've got a busy day today, so I'm glad I got a good sweat in. And now we can start our little work day, actually a very big work day. And then I also am going to get my nails done at three. So for the next four or five hours, we've got to grind out some work. Also need to pack tonight and need to, I'm, or I am going to get um, my hair blown out as well. So I'm going to dry bar. I'm so sore from CrossFit the other day. I can hardly even do one single ab exercise, but hopefully I feel a little bit better in the next couple days because that has been brutal, which a lot of people said that they felt like that too after CrossFit for the first time. So I'm not super surprised, but holy moly, it like hurts to laugh. <laughs> yeah. So I'll see you guys at home and yeah, good workout. I'm trying these coconut wraps for my lunch today. I'm not sure I'm doing them correctly. They burn in like, 0.25 seconds, but they're not like crispy. They don't smell right. They don't. I don't know. I was planning on putting my cod in there, but I do not know about all of this. I've got cod, spring mix, and ketchup right there, and I was just planning on trying to wrap them up in this. Y'all, this is like my third one I've burnt. I ended up scratching the idea of doing it with my cod. I mean, I did have it with the cod, and it was so burnt, so I was like, yeah, maybe I just don't like it burnt. Uh, or cooked, I mean. So I did frozen berries, some PB Fit, and then I'm gonna do a little bit of honey, wrap it up, and try it that way. About to get my nails done, but first we're going to Starbucks. Hi. For the ice fashion tea. Ice fashion tea. Thank you. Thank you. Would you like to use your voice booster? Yes, that would be awesome. Thank you. Alrighty, Ms. Lily, that came out to the Lola Press Thank you. <laughs> Have a good one. Okay. Oh, yes, a straw, please. Thank you so much. Here you go. Thank you. Have a good one. Okay. 
Okay, this one's always so chaotic to get out of. But I got an ice passion tea. Ice Passion Tango Tea is what I got. And now we're headed to get our nails done. And they are currently dipped, but I'm going to get a Russian manicure. I don't know if I've told you guys that. I booked this appointment probably like a month and a half ago. This girl stays booked and busy. So I'm really hoping that it's worth it. And then I'll just probably like book out my next ones if so. Um, so we're gonna head there. Got my nails done and it was honestly a very long appointment, but for the Russian manicure, she did such an incredible job and paid so much attention to detail. I love it. I actually don't know the color of this. I just said like something similar to Funny Bunny and I think this looks pretty similar. Hair is complete. We did the straight up at Dry Bar and it will end up being like pretty straight. She did a little bit of, she put the rollers in so that I would have some volume, but by the time I sleep on it tomorrow, it probably won't have that much volume. I just love the straight up because it kind of, I don't know, it like keeps the shape of looking like a blowout, but if I just tell her I want it straight, then it just looks really flat. So the straight up at dry wear. Packing is going down right now. I'm a little, I don't know. Like, I don't know what to pack for like 50s and 60 degree weather and like low of 40s. And there's a dress code for this. Like, you're not dress code. They've got like a theme for colors. And it's this color and then pink, which the pink outfit that I got, I accidentally got two of the tops and not the skirt. It's like a two-piece set. But I actually think I would have been too cold in that anyways. So... Bring these, but I think I'll probably will end up wearing more of like neutrals because these are the ones with long sleeve options. We're gonna, yeah, we're gonna give myself options when we get there, but I'm in the midst of packing right now. My least favorite thing in the world. <laughs> so excited for tomorrow though. So excited to leave in the morning. I think that we have to be up, probably have to leave here by 5.50 yeah an early morning ahead because we fly out at eight yeah yeah that sounds about right to me i'm the type of person that has to be to the airport like two hours before are y'all like that or are you guys the type that just don't want to spend more time than what you need at the airport and then you just live on the edge not i good morning guys i'm gonna head to the airport here soon it's 5 a.m literally still wrapped up in my blanket right now making coffee and i am so excited At our gate, look what I brought with me. I got a nitro cold brew. Jay got a cold brew. And we're trying to not fall behind on water, so we got four waters. $74 later in <laughs> water. First stop is Sweet Green. I am absolutely starving. Breakfast. I know, and it seems so weird because it's like lunchtime here, but it, we've been up for a long time. <laughs> so cute in here. Thank you, Lord. Time to eat. Thank you, Lord is right. What is it, 3 p.m. our time? Yes. Oh, bless. We both got the harvest bowl. Oh my gosh. I got the honey barbecue this time though. I've never gotten it and I've never even seen that. But also the balsamic on the side. But I'm gonna do the honey barbecue because I love some honey barbecue. About to take a berries class with Jay here. We're gonna get a workout. Well, a berries class is 
uh, about 17 times harder when you have been traveling all day, but wow, was that needed. Am I right? <laughs> yes, great workout, great coach. I know, he was awesome. His name was Garrett, right? And yeah. we went to the West Hollywood one, and apparently that's the original berry. We forgot to get those shirts. Tomorrow we're gonna get them, the ones that say Berries Los Angeles, because they're really cool shirts in there. Anyways, workout complete, and we're headed to go get a snack, but just had to update y'all. You guys know our post-workout is <laughs> gonna be the Giselles. I got the peanut butter and jelly bar, and Jay got the protein bar, and we're gonna do half and half. Whenever Jay and I are having a fun time and we're doing something fun, we say, I love doing life with you. <laughs> love doing life with you. Life is so fun together. <laughs> Just made it to our hotel room and oh my gosh, that's so cute here. But also in Puerto Rico, I was just there with Sol de Janeiro and look what I'm here with. Amazon, if I have not already said that, I don't know if I have, but look at all of these goodies. I love some Laneige. Oh my gosh, Sol de Janeiro, you have my heart. And then some Paul Mitchell, what? A dream. We're here with the Amazon influencers and it's the spring favorites event. So I am just freaking excited. It's so cute in here. Look at these little treats right here. Oranges. Oh my gosh. It is adorable. And then here's the bathroom. Love. Ah, I'm so happy to be here. I've always heard about this hotel, but I've obviously never been here before. Y'all, I have hit a slump. What the heck? So it is currently 7 15 or so here in California and that's like 10 15 yeah that's 10 15 my time which I did this the whole time I was in California last time because I'm like that's a really big difference like this is bedtime for me and also a full day of traveling so I have hit a wall a little bit we are on top of a lamp right now here's the outfit for night one I actually really really like this I've never even tried it on it just came in the other day and when I'm on my period, I feel horrible in everything that I wear. So I figured if I tried everything on ahead of time, I would get overwhelmed, hate everything I'm wearing, and not want to come on the trip. That's, I would have come. Obviously, I would have come. But I'm just saying I would have gotten like, oh my gosh, I have nothing to wear, stressed out. So instead, I was like, I'm going to deal with this when I get there. Because I can only be so stressed when I only have a couple options and I'm already here. That was my logic. And it worked out okay because I actually really, really like this. I got this from Revolve. I'll have to link it, but I don't remember which brand exactly it is. But I think it looks really cute. And then I'm wearing these Inda heels, I think is what these ones are by. I actually don't know what these are by. I'll have to... I'll have to look. Maybe lovers and friends. Um, Gretchen was wearing them in the last couple times I've seen her. And I was like, yeah, I actually need those. Those look good with everything. And I'm going to use my little YSL purse, which maybe I'll just record on my on my phone, I guess. I really want to bring my camera. Maybe I'll just bring my vlogging camera, whatever. And yeah, I wish I had an energy drink or something. Maybe I should ask Jay to bring one <laughs> because... Holy Moses, I'm tired, but I don't want to like drink an energy drink and then be up all night. Ah, but I'm super excited. Tonight is like night one. I think it's a dinner, which I doubt I'm going to really be like hungry because I already ate and it is so late my time. So I guess it's just going to be kind of like a social hour time to like meet a bunch of people. It's so weird because I don't know one single person here. So I don't even know what to expect, but it's going to be awesome. guys I feel like an owe an explanation because I didn't bring my vlogging camera last night but last night was so good so it was the opening dinner for the Amazon influencer event so a bunch of other Amazon influencers are here and 
I think there's probably, I don't know, like some, some people were Amazon, they work for the Amazon influencer program. So I don't know how many girls are here that are actually Amazon influencers, but it was awesome to meet everyone. And we all kind of felt the same where we didn't have a plus one with us. So we were just meeting, like you couldn't bring a plus one. So you were just meeting a bunch of other people who didn't know you, how you didn't know them. Like everyone was in the same boat where they didn't have, they didn't come with someone, I guess I should say. And so we sat down, had such a nice dinner there was salmon there was dessert there were mocktails and cocktails and all sorts of stuff it was they went above and beyond and there were different storefronts which it was cool uh seeing like Laneige and there was Sol de Janeiro which is so funny because I just was in Puerto Rico doing all of that with Sol de Janeiro like everywhere I go Sol de Janeiro <laughs> and today I think that I'm going to end off this vlog and start a new one because this was kind of just like a prep with me get ready for my trip and travel here so I'm gonna end off this vlog today we've got lots of fun stuff going on so you guys will have to watch my next vlog for the rest of the California trip I keep saying it's a weekend because it doesn't feel right being out of town during the middle of the week but it's literally Wednesday right now so I'm gonna do a Wednesday and Thursday vlog and I will see you guys in my next one I love y'all I adore y'all and thanks so much for watching